Hello, my lovely Taurus. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Taurus, welcome to your daily reading. This will be for February 6 and 7, 2020. It's a general reading, my loves. Take it accordingly. Sun, Moon, Rising Science and Venus Science. Let's hear, my loves. We have a message from the Angels Oracle card. And I will use it as an advice for all of you. And of course, we have our keeper messages from the Finge Circle. This are for Tune Telling Tell Deck and our messages from the Tarot. Let's hear Taurus while we got here. Sun, Moon, Rising Science and Venus Science for you loves. We have what do you desire and underneath we have go for it wow whatever you desire my love go for it but let's see here what do you desire you know you now have the opportunity to write the script according to your heart's true desires once you clearly decide upon your true desires and you know that you are ready and deserving of them, they'll rush into your life as if by magic. That's a very, very beautiful message for you, my lovely Taurus. Okay? Whatever it is, be very clear and be putting the energy into that thought, into that thing here. Let's see here, Taurus. What's your message here behind the keeper? We have judication. We have distant horizons. For some of you, you are thinking to, to move over the seas or you are changing locations where you are living here. For some of you, your family is helping or your family is giving you some advices here. I see very strongly advices from your family, for some of you, for the pe from the people you are really caring. Okay? If you feel a struggle right now where you are, you are very concerned even like, if I'll stay where I am, how that will be in a month, two, or even ten. But the universe is blessing you here with something marvelous and is telling you, whatever you go, that will be very prosperous. Although, somebody here tries Taurus to keep you next to them or something of that extent. I will say do not trust that person. She or he is wearing a false mask. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, I see you on a new journey somewhere different than where you are. Beautiful energy here for you, lovely Taurus. If you are planning a move, or needs to detach yourself from somebody. Spirit says you are allowed to do that and that will be in a short time. For some of you I see somebody is selling a home because you feel like this is not me and I don't feel good in this place. For some of you, energetically move from a situation. Because sometimes when I do see a move, it's not necessary that you make a move. It's many times is energetically move from a thing to another. For those of you who do know about energetic work, uh, that sometimes helps you to clear the energies around you. Some of you may do, you know, a salt bath of clearing energy. For some of you, you just white a light candle or a white candle. For some of you, you just do sage your home or even holy watering your home. Depends 
through what you believe because many of you asked me what is good to cleanse the home and I do cleanse my home with holy water sometimes I sage my home so whatever you feel that works for you and whatever you believe in that will cleanse your home let's see here Taurus somebody here is really rushing in here but I don't feel it's kind of it's a fear of something some of you you are really want to move somewhere but is that fear like I'm not sure if I can make it I'm not sure if I can go it yeah let's see but some of you might have problems at work or you might feel it's never enough slowly slowly you want to move on from that but some of you feel like something is slow and needs to go forward it is a job you put a lot of work into but it's just like you got to a, to a situation, to a realization that as much as you try to work things, never is enough. For some of you, you might deal here Taurus with a Libra. Could be a fire sign, a Libra. I don't know why I do say Libra. But I definitely see here there is a, not a give and take. There is something is not going the way it's supposed to or... It's basically like you move in a direction you think it's good for you. They move in their direction. For some of you, the energies are very much, very different. It's like, it's not that attraction. It's just like separation more and more and more. Let's see here what this is about. Two of Pentacles. Uncertainty what's work and what's not some of you manifesting something new yeah for some of you is done and over for some of you Taurus you deal with another Taurus Virgo Capricorn okay I see also a fire sign Leo Sag and here's my Libra sometimes you know the Empress is you my loves but I definitely see here wherever you are going you will make it right for you and I see you growing although I see a lot of healing as you see here in the future they are all major arcanas for some of you Tauruses you are very very spiritual we have out of that here five cards which they are major arcanas for some of you it's just like leaving something behind could be a work situation, could be a love situation, but you manifesting something new, but you feel that new thing will not be where you are, needs to be somewhere else. Although you feel kind of a, cons a, a straining out there. Yeah, for some of you, you might move towards a fire sign here. With who you are dealing, that's that's like not not there although there are some obligations over there there are some obligations over there you need to do but you do have a very strong offer here very very promising offer okay could be a love offer could be a work offer although seems to me a very good one if it's about it's about money you got this because king of wands is somebody who is entrepreneur also king of pentacles as i'm seeing as you are very wise very grounded business person if it's something about work leaving something behind will give you a new opportunity for way beyond your wildest dreams the money you wish and I feel here wherever you are going that's something amazing but some of you is like a life-changing situation and that needs to do for what you 
believed before or what you felt that you are stuck into. Somebody here needs to just jump from a cliff. I'm not saying you to need to jump on the cliff. That is a metaphor type because I feel here somebody here is sticky and like, oh, I'm, I'm holding on, I don't know what to do. I work very hard for something. For some of you, definitely, you live could be a, a long-term job, could be even 10 years job. Okay, could be longer. For some of you, you want to leave something which is very unfulfilling. And that is kind of for over two years trying to do so, and it's hard. For those of you who really want to leave something behind, is is a partner, it's a life partner, that person. And I feel here you really are attracted towards somebody else. And that person is full of charm. That person has a lot of passion. And it's kind of just when you think of that person, it's giving you chills. Let's see here, why was this two of pentacles for my lovely Taurus? Yeah. Should I start something new or not? Should I go towards something or not? I feel here you you know what I'm talking about here. Piscean energy here, Taurus. But you know, deep inside you know what you gotta do. Yeah, leaving something behind for something new is like a burden. For some of you, yes, yeah, could be a marriage. And could be a convenience marriage, could be for kids, could be you are the one who provides, or you always been there for somebody. But I definitely see here, it is something new. Yeah, for some of you, you might leave a water sign behind. And I feel here, that was a lot in your mind. You've been analyzing a lot. For some of you, you have kids here with this person. Although, I don't see too much conflict here. But I see you. For some of you, this person doesn't understand you. I see a very spiritual Taurus here. Very much into the beliefs of spirituality. And do not mistaken spirituality with religion okay my loves it's a very different topic we all have our own religion we all believe in things but we have our universe I feel here you were thinking quite a bit here for some of you could be a year here wow it is somebody in your head could be this fire sign you want to be with and you feel like they are the one you are looking for let's see here yeah this is you my loves you are thinking here you are thinking here between two people, between a water sign and a fire sign. Yeah, you have a lot of passion. This person is single. It's kind of they are waiting for you. They offer you something, but you feel like the obligation, the restrainings. For some of you, you have teenagers. I see two teenagers and one smaller kid. For some of you, you do have children with a past person. Or you felt hard to move on again from a fire, from a water sign. But now you you feel like now the time my time is up. I need to go. One more card. Yeah. You need to go. There is something new coming to you although spirit says be again be be sure what you want there is need some healing here but I see here somebody is even daydreaming and I know you Taurus you are fixed sign and 
it is what it is but sometimes Taurus love hard and it is somebody here very very strong passionate towards you we have ace of cups ace of pentacles and ace of wands the only ace is missing my loves is ace of swords the clarity be crystal clear what you want or be honest with yourself what do you want okay and again the star is what you are dreaming for what your big desires are what your deep deep inside thoughts are there with this Aquarius energy yeah let's see here one advice for you Taurus one advice for lovely Taurus here one advice for Taurus take your time no rush even you feel rushed type here but I feel here eventually you will walk away you will move towards the person you want but again when we have king of swords is that king who I do know what I want I need to make plans for this and for that and I feel here you are thinking what's the next move you gotta have although yes the relationship you are in it is cold might be some energy of your person could be over the top of everything or try to but I feel here now you need to take your power to do what is right for you and sometimes people judging like why they need to leave a marriage and many of us are in relationship not necessarily marriages that you put years in those connection but there is not so ever honesty or not so ever that strong energy so there is no judging here we all have on this earthly a life and we need to live it every day to the fully and be happy and I definitely see here a Taurus who really wants to be happy okay and in extent I feel here even now the person you are right now they will not truly understand later on they will and it's kind of they will wish you the happiness even they will, will not be so happy but they do sense if you're dealing with a water sign water signs, water signs are very sensitive and they do get you very quickly so yes lovely Taurus this is what I got for you and I thank you for watching and being here on the channel many blessings to all of you and we'll see you next time bye for now